You don't look okay. I'm fine. Thank you. <sighs> this I just can't walk away. You don't look good. Are you okay? What's wrong? You look really happy. Yeah. My son just had a baby. I'm a grandfather again. Second time. Congratulations. Thank you, thank you. Are you from Coney Island? Um, I'm from Westchester. Westchester? Yeah. What are you doing in Coney Island? Just, uh, just wanted to visit the place, spend some time. Do you know a lot of people around here? Yeah, I know a lot of people here. They call me the mayor. Is there something bothering you in particular? Um. Unfortunately, yeah. <laughs> Um, do you, do you know anyone named Dima? What do you need Dima for? Who is Dima? Um, I made a huge mistake. That's okay. Nobody's perfect. 
Listen, King David made mistakes. Moses made mistakes. Joseph made mistakes. Noah made mistakes. Some of the holiest people to ever walk the face of this earth made mistakes. So if you made a mistake, you're only human. Nobody's perfect. I really have to find this guy. What happened? About a month ago, I um, I went to this opening for a new exhibit at the Met. And I met uh, Dima there. He's a really nice guy, really sweet, really polite. And um, we just spent the entire night just you know, talking to one another. Um, and we really connected. I don't really get out much. I don't really have a lot of friends. Or really a lot of people that I talk to. So I was <laughs> really happy to just spend the time with someone, you know. And I mean, we had a few drinks. And once the night started to get to an end, I, I didn't want to just go home alone. I, my intentions weren't, you know, to do anything. I just, I had a great time. I didn't want to, you know, get rid of that, like, companionship. He was a really nice guy, so, you know. I wanted to make sure I would, like, see him again, you know, some other time. But anyway, everything happened, and I found out that, um, Afterward, that uh, he's he's married. So uh, of course that was the end of it. But uh, he told me he was from Coney Island and he liked to come to the beach on weekends. So uh, I came out here to find him to tell him that um. that I'll be having his child. You're pregnant? Yeah. Are you kidding me? Whoa. Do your parents know? Uh, not yet. No one knows. Well, you know, but... How's your relationship with your parents? It's good. I don't know how I'm going to tell them about this, but um, I'll figure it out. Yeah. My mom's a professor and my dad's a doctor. So, um. Whoa. Come from a smart family. Yeah. This isn't something I would usually uh, do necessarily, so. Do you have any brothers or sisters? I have a brother, a younger brother. Um, he has a health challenge. He's all, he's autistic. So, so my parents really, really, really rely on me for everything, pretty much. And um, I love him so much, so I'm going to be the one to take care of him. You're a good soul. Thank you. you know, your father's a doctor, your mother's a professor. What do you do? I just finished uh, my master's. And I, uh, I got into the PhD program at um, NYU for physics, so. Ho, ho, ho. Hey. What does this guy look like? He had uh, dark brown hair, uh, dark brown eyes, chiseled face. He spoke Russian, but um, he looked Asian. Why didn't you know this? Well, my name is Da Vinci, and that's what I do for a living until I retire. I could make a forensic sketch of. Dima. I'll make him the most famous guy in Coney Island. 
I'll put up little posters of Dima. I'll say, I have something that belongs to you. If he's married, I don't, I don't want to embarrass him or anything. It's too much. I don't want to destroy his marriage or anything like that. It's okay. You're a good soul. I'll make a little sketch for myself. I'll give it to a few of my buddies at the precinct. I'm going to try to find this guy for you. Okay. Feel a little better? I mean, not yet, but hopefully I will. Everything is going to be okay. Let me know when you want to come back to Coney. I'll have the sketch ready. And we will find Dima. Well, I'm really happy that, that I finally got to open up about it. I didn't really have anyone else to uh, talk about it to, so thank you for listening. It's my pleasure. But now I won't be looking alone, so thank you for that as well. It's the right thing to do. Yeah. And maybe, um, maybe someday, um, My baby and your grandchild can be uh, best friends. I'll make it happen. 